It's normally a, f a big family reunion. It's a celebration as an organization community that we come together. This year it's extra special. Craftsmen are putting the finishing touches on their booths as the 88th League of New Hampshire Craftsmen's Fair gets ready to open. Last year, the fair was virtual because of the pandemic. Iris Mink is looking forward to seeing customers in person again. I always get to make some, you know, more special pieces that have more of my soul in them because I know people will appreciate it here. With the Delta variant on the rise, the fair is not requiring people to mask up, but they will have masks available. We are not mandating masks. We're encouraging those who need to wear them to wear them, and we're mostly encouraging consideration. The fair opens Saturday and runs through the 15th from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m., rain or shine. There is a wide range of crafts available, and the executive director says it's a misconception that you need to get there on the first day to get the best stuff. There's plenty to, to buy throughout the, the fair, especially since we've had you know, an additional 16 months to make work. And if you want to come and just look and experience craft, it's wonderful. You can also learn how to make craft because we have demonstrations and hands-on as well as those that you observe. The fair is encouraging people to buy their tickets in advance. You can do that by going to nhcrafts.org. At Mount Sunapee, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.